We talked to you earlier about creating ground force, understanding how to use the ground as, as something that's gonna generate some club head speed. Here's the image that I want you to have. I want you to imagine this is a starting block and I'm going to go run, say, a 100 meter dash. When you get into this, what you're gonna do is in order to propel your weight in this direction here, your foot, knee, and leg, they're gonna all push back like that. That's the purpose of having this on an angle is that it's gonna allow you to push off against this and generate forward momentum. Well, that's what's happening when you're hitting a golf ball. We need to understand that when we use the ground properly, that the pressure or the, the ground force is going in the opposite direction of where we're going. So in my trail foot, my trail foot is actually going this way to create the speed and spin of the hips. And my lead foot, when it's pushing off this way, it's pushing into the ground like that. So the weight is going from the toe up to the hip in this fashion here, that's how we're getting that hip to spin back. So our feet, the, the work of the ground is going the opposite direction of where the hips are going. The ground is working one way, the hips are working in the opposite direction. So when I'm moving my hip this way, in a forward direction towards the target, my trail foot's gonna go back like that. And then this hip is going down here, as it's rotating in this fashion, I'm getting a push from the ground in that fashion there. So what I'm doing is I'm pushing and jumping like that. And as we start to understand how to use this ground properly, now we're gonna be able to start to generate some club head speed. So when I get set up to hit this, I have this image in my mind that at the top of the swing, I'm gonna really feel this leg pushing against that way and this leg is gonna push in the opposite direction. And watch what happens to the club head speed here. So that one there is, a, and I really got into that. This one here, this is a pretty solid strike. Normally for me, my six iron is about, say, 180 to 85. That one there's 200. Club head speed, ball speed, they all go up. And the reason why they go up is, is that when I'm thinking about being able to use the, the, the ground properly, all of a sudden I generate more club head speed.